Happening here, it's a not-so-scary Halloween outing that you can bring your entire family to. It is time for Burnside Park's spooky story time and haunted art. From pumpkin painting to even, yes, a dance party. This has my attention. This morning, we have Ricky Kadowitz here with us, a local artist and guest reader, professional waiver extraordinaire, who can tell us all about the fun event. Good morning, Ricky. Good morning, Brendan. Great to have you here. Thanks. So what do we need to know here? I love these family activities that all ages can enjoy. They really enhance the spirit of the season, whether it be Halloween, the fall, this is what we really want. What do we need to know? Okay, so this is a free event that happens in Birdside Park, downtown Providence. Um, we've been doing it for a number of years. Um, there are a lot of activities. There are crafts to be made. Um, you could make your own costume, even. Um, there'll be like t-shirts. You could, if you would like. To, I like this. You know, invisible right there. <laughs> invisible. Like, <laughs> so, I'm invisible. But you could, you could make um, any costume you'd like. And that's the beauty of art, that is the beauty of Halloween, those two intersecting in a way, really exploding the popularity of Halloween. It knows no limits, and this is a fun way to enhance that spirit. Yeah, totally. So let's talk, uh, it's this Saturday, correct? I know weather looks a little iffy, but what do we need to know in terms of, uh, you said it's free, so we don't need tickets, but in terms of what's happening, we should pl just plan to show up, right? Sure, yeah, so it starts at 10.30, goes to about 1.30. Um, there'll be stories read from about 10.30 to 11.30. Um, myself and Allison Paul, who's an uh, author and illustrator, local author and illustrator, um, will read some of our favorite ghost stories. I've got a bunch of ghost stories. What are some of your favorites? <laughs> or is the list so long we wouldn't yeah. have time? I do have a book literally just called Ghosts. Um, so that's one I'm going to be reading. And it must be so endlessly enjoyable for you, for the entire team that puts this together, to see families having fun, really just to come mm -hmm. out to Providence to really showcase the creative capital, all that it has to offer, yeah. right there in a beautiful setting. Yeah. And there's a lot of really nice moments with kids and their families. Um, it's just a, a nice way to be together. Is there a participation aspect for the kids where they can get involved with yeah. you? Obviously you encourage them to be part of things. In what other capacities can they look to get involved? So some of the activities, there's one called Guess the Guts, where you um, like dig your hands into boxes and things and look for eyeballs or whatever, whatever, whatever it might be. It's not real, but you know. But of cute. course, <laughs> well, it, it's fun, it's interactive, and it's something mm -hmm. that you know they can remember. Yep. And let's talk about why it's really important that we hold events like this da in downtown Providence. I mean, any Anything that can rally the community together, anything that can bring us together, whether it's for families, kids, adults, really is important to Rhode Island overall, isn't Absolutely. it? Absolutely, yeah. Um, there actually is this nice spot within the park called the Imagination Center that's been transformed into a uh, haunted house from Shel Silverstein book um, where the sidewalk ends. There's a poem in here called Enter This Deserted House. Well, let's read it together. <laughs> but I please, what, no. <laughs> we'll but there, is this, there is this nice um, mural of this um, haunted house painted on the side of the Imagination Center and kids can actually enter this deserted house and uh, be part of the experience and even like make a little goblin that could add to the experience of being in the deserted house. And anytime I'm down there in Birdside Park, you know, it's it's remarkable the transformation, the wonderful positive things that are happening. It must be so just fun and rewarding for you to just be a part of that positive energy going on. Yeah, that's definitely one of the best parts. That yeah. really is <laughs> yeah. what it's all about indeed. And is this kind of how you got inspired to be in, involved in this kind of thing, to these types of works? Um, yeah, I mean, children's books were a huge inspiration for me growing up and they've remained, they've remained such. So, um, yeah, that, kids' television shows, um, crafting, making, it's been part of my life since That's I was a kid. What so. it's all about. Well, yeah. Ricky, thank you so much for joining us right here today. We wish you thank the you. best of luck with this great event. If you guys would like to celebrate <laughs> Halloween, bring the kids, bring the whole family, and to get more information on the event happening at Burnside Park and everything that's happening in that lovely area down there, just visit us at roadshow.com.